Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to learn how we can use tooltip component of material UI in React. So how we can do this? You see in previous video, we have seen this lecture, how we can create a list here and how this list will behave like a, this. So now I want to uh, I want to give information that whenever I will just do this cursor on this list, it should display some tooltips. So how it can do? We are going to learn here. So you see that we create this list and we have here under this list item I have with this list item text. So this list item text I will enclose under the tooltip component. So I said tooltip like this. Import this. Under this tooltip, I will uh, put this text information and here I use title property and here I pass uh, information that information would be of row that I am displaying here the list item 1. This information I pass here, save this so it will show primary text 1. And you see that if I take cursor here, so I have this tooltip, I have here tooltip, I have here tooltip. So I can give position also this tooltip uh, like that. I can say uh, the placement of this tooltip is, I say it should be uh, toward the left side. So you see now it will come in left side like this coming here and uh, it can come to the right side also. So if I see here, if I put this value, the option, you will see that we have uh, these 12 options where we can set this tooltips, bottom, bottom, end, bottom, start, left, left, and left, start, right, right, and right, start. So I can say it is to right side also. You see, we have right side also. We have left, left side also. Now what I can do, I can uh, have some uh, row type of information here. So uh, arrow type of information, I say arrow property here and you will see that it will show the arrow toward this. You see its arrow is coming here, this arrow. You see this arrow is coming, this arrow is coming. And if I say it to, uh, you can say top like this and you see that it is coming like this arrow toward the bottom side. And if I say left side, save this. And you see that now the arrow is coming toward this from the right side like that. And we may have a few more property also. So we can say a delay property of this. So I say enter delay, enter delay and leave delay. So here delay property I say 300 millisecond and I say leave delay, leave delay also that leave delay we can also pass 200. So what is the info, what is the meaning of this? Uh, this is the uh, delay that will take to uh, you can say to display the tooltip and to hide the tooltips. You see that if I take cursor here, so after 300 millisecond it will display, and if I remove it will go after you see 200 millisecond. So I can increase this uh, size. I say it will come after 400 of millisecond. And it will display after 500 of millisecond. You see that it will take so much of time. You see now it coming and if I leave this, so it will stay for coming. It will stay for 500 millisecond, 400 millisecond it will come. So we can decide the uh, display time and hiding time of this by using enter delay and leave delay property here. Then arrow property we can des decide the uh, the arrow uh, for this it will pointing to the this arrow will pointing to the property to which he is showing the tooltip so it is showing the tooltips for primary information so its arrow is toward the primary side you see now it is to secondary side and we can give the position also what we want we want it from top from bottom from left right center where we want we can give the information so these uh, tooltip we can also use 
for each and every component here we have a list box so uh, I just remove the list from this now I use another component I have a icon button icon button example so I use this component also and I remove this save this uh, now you see that we have this icon property here I want to show this so I can show this also and here I go there and after this icon button I use tooltip so I set tooltip and uh, I just cut this paste this icon button inside this now I say title and then I say tooltip this is send icon save this again I say arrow also I can have delay property also you can use if you require so you see if I go there then it show this is send icon but it's coming here in bottom so I can give the placement also placement and I say this placement toward the right side now you see it will come to the right side this is the send icon you see so this kind of information we may use if we require tooltip to give extra information about any component to the user that we can do by using this tooltip so i have given you idea that you can use on list also you can use on icon button also you can use on any component on which you want to show some information to the user that's all in this video if you learn something please do subscribe thank you for watching this video